Hello, I'm Executive Chef Joseph Schotza, and welcome to our kitchen. Today I'd like to share with you a recipe and technique for making preserved lemons. Preserved lemons have quickly become a favorite in this house. They help uh, add depth to soups, stews, sauces. Uh, you can use it in Southern Asian cuisine. You also find it predominantly with uh, North African cuisines, uh, Tunisia, Morocco, Algeria. So without further ado, join me now as I show you how to prepare this. To begin, I wanna take my jar that I will be preserving these in, and I wanna add some kosher salt. Uh, just enough to cover the bottom by, you know, a quarter inch, half inch or so. And then the remaining salt, I'll dump into a bowl. Then I would like to add one bay leaf and one third of the mixed peppercorns. Now to prepare the lemon, what I like to do is I always cut the stem side off and um, just lub, nub off a little bit of it. And I'm gonna take this off too. I wanna make certain that there's no blemishes on the lemons. Also, you want to wash them and scrub them very well. So next, let's go ahead and cut our lemon into quarters, but do not cut all the way through the other side. What I like to do is keep it maybe a quarter inch or so from the end. Turn it 90 degrees and go ahead again. And then repeat this with all of your lemons. Next, Take your lemon and gently spread them open. And now go ahead and salt them very well. Now once you have it salted really well, go ahead and close them and go ahead and put into your jar and press down on it slightly. Continue with the other lemons. Okay, so now I have the lemons uh, salted. Go ahead and take some lemon juice and pour into your jar. Then go ahead and put another lemon in and press down. Then go ahead and add bay leaf, another one third of the peppercorns, put in your next lemon. Now that we have our lemons in the jar, go ahead and press down a little more. You want to make certain that your lemons are completely submerged. Let's go ahead and add the last bay leaf and the peppercorns. And as this is sticking above the juice level, let's go ahead and take some of this liquid and pour into it until it's completely covered. We will now wipe our jar off, close it up, and we will put it in a, a dark, cool place, whether it's basement or pantry. Go ahead and leave it there for 30 days. Well, there you have my technique for making preserved lemons. Absolutely love this. I many times when I'm making uh, a lemon risotto, or even uh, lemon mashed potatoes, or even a roasted potato tossed with uh, some preserved lemon, it's fantastic. Um, Asian cooking, I will use it, and sometimes just in soups and stews, as I mentioned earlier in the uh, demonstration. Um, one of my favorite dishes with it is a bucatini pasta and using smoked salmon and uh, making a tarragon cream and then adding the uh, preserved lemon at the very end, fold it together, really adds nice flavor profile and pairs everything great together. Even throwing a little bit of uh, black caviar or flying fish roe on top of that to really make it pop. Well, I hope you enjoyed the demonstration. I hope you give it a try. Uh, let me know if, uh, how it turns out if you get to try it. 
Um, if you've not done so, please uh, feel free to subscribe to our channel. We'd love to have you on board and uh, hit that notification bell. That way you could be up to speed every time we post. Thank you again for joining. You like that.